anyway <laughs> anyway what's up y'all what's up i hope everybody's having a good afternoon so far you know i ain't feel like getting dressed if i got on my uniform because i don't wear my uniform <laughs> you know and, and, and you know it is what it is but um anyway um welcome to my conversations um, they will be on a folder on YouTube depending how long they are. Sometimes I throw them on my jewelry page. Um, Sometimes I throw them on my TikTok if they are short enough. But uh, welcome, welcome. Let's talk about self-pity, self manipulation. Um, it was self-pity, manipulation, and there was another word I wanted to say. Now, I talk to a lot of people, and this goes across the board from my office to people I run into to my family members. Now, I'm a little tired of hearing about, I'm a little tired of people with this self-pity thing. Sometimes self-pity is nothing but a manipulation tactic to make people feel sorry for you so you can do something for them that they can do for themselves. Now, I know multiple people like this. I understand there are certain circumstances where you cannot physically do anything for yourself or you're in a bad situation and you can't do for self. But when you're a grown person, a grown up, and you don't have no super duper physical disabilities because at the end of the day, everyone, um, there's everyone can do something for themselves. It's not like you're a vegetable or anything like that. I had enough of people with a, a, a self-pity attitude because they're too lazy to do for themselves and they want everyone else to do the work for them because they are lazy, pretty much. When you're a grown person, you can walk, you can talk, you can see, you can still move, some of you can walk. Some of you come from all different types of walks of life. If you got to have four jobs to make it, then that's what you got to do. Stop whining about your situation and start, and, and start looking for ways to solve it. 2024, what they call the new year. <laughs> I ain't even getting all that. Start Stop whining about your situation and start looking for solutions. I am not going to keep putting band-aids on problems, okay, that need to die. This, 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 um, this right here needs to be obliterated. It needs to die because this habit right here is destroying you. I said it like they on my side. You just don't know because it like they be on your side. But um, any but anywho, I don't want to hear woe is me, woe is me, woe is me all the time. What you gonna do about your situation? It's time to stop doing self pity and manipulation to get people to do what you don't want to do for yourself that you can do for yourself. Stop looking for other people to solve your problems for you. And start trying to solve some of your problems yourselves. I don't, I don't go to people and expect them to solve everything and do everything for me. That's being a lazy person. Now, when I do this, I know... I know one person who would definitely think I'm talking about her. Ooh, and my, my thing fell. Now, I do have a parent who is disabled.
Well, so I understand that she cannot do certain things, but there are things that you can do, you just don't want to do. You get what I'm saying? Or there are people that I, I know that always telling me, woe is me, and they're waiting on someone to take care of them or do for them because of whatever situation they are in. Sometimes you have to learn to sacrifice and go without and do what you got to do and find ways around things in order to get where you need to be instead of waiting on people to come save you save you um that's all i wanted to say that's all i wanted to say it's it's, it's time out for self-pity and manipulation and laziness because you don't want to do the work in whatever area it is to better yourself and i'm just saying that as a wide range i understand that some things you just cannot help but whatever you can change change it no one said it was going to be easy life is not easy god never promised you life was going to be easy we all going through stuff so who are you to think that you are above suffering when even Christ suffered. So who are you to think that you ain't got to suffer at all? Alright? Have a good one.